What's going on YouTube? Jeans here bringing you guys a brand new playthrough for the channel and ladies and gentlemen This is one of my favorite game series on planet earth. We got ourselves the Pikmin series Pikmin 3 Deluxe This game is phenomenal I played it for the Wii U and I cannot wait to hop into this one and actually play the new deluxe version But guys if you guys haven't tried out a Pikmin game ever start with this one get after it with this one I'm telling you, you can start anywhere with them. They are phenomenal. Tons of fun to play and an absolute blast. But if you guys are excited for this new series, make sure you support the channel by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. Thank you guys so much for the support that has been going out across this channel. But without further ado, let's get rolling into this playthrough. We got ourselves part one rolling here. We're going to start the story mode. How many players? Yeah, one. It's just your boy Jeans over here. We can get started on solo player here. And we got, oh, we can create a new save that. A normal hard. We're going to go with the normal thing. We're going to go with the normal normal difficulty and then maybe depending on how this playthrough goes through maybe we'll go hard and maybe ultra spicy mode but this game is amazing it really is it really is here's a little intro the planet's name with all the guys we are going to be little astronauts who land on like a different planet and we are we're so tiny we're just so tiny you're like running through grass fighting bugs and all that and you form an army of pikmin and Pikmin are those little guys, you guys know what Pikmin are, and you just use them for your advantage, they all do different things. It's actually a very, like, strategic, pretty cool solo player game, I absolutely love this series. Like I said, if you guys haven't tried out any Pikmin games yet, get on it, get on top of it, they are seriously phenomenal, they really are. But this is just like a little intro, it's nothing too special, can I skip it actually? I cannot, that is wild so I just want to get in, oh I actually can skip it, yes sir, yes sir, I can skip it. But exploration day number one. So the way that this game works, it goes through days. It goes through days. So every day is like a different level. There's like 30 days, I think. I think there's a total of 30 days or maybe less. Cool. It, it really depends. But still, you have like a certain amount of time to actually uh, get your your days done and all that. But let's get it. So here's just a, like a little intro. We are, I forget this guy's game name right here. We can actually move up here. Let's get it, yo. My boy, huh? What in the... So these guys just land on like a different planet. Like I said, they're like mini astronauts right here. And there's my boy. Yo, can I talk to Pikmin? Or do I just keep moving forward? Pikmin's. What's goody, man? Do I gotta go over here? Yo, what is good? Yo, we got yellow Pikmin. So yellow Pikmin are actually electric Pikmin right here. And each each uh, Pikmin, like I said, does something special. The red ones are fire. The, the blue ones are water. There's a rock one. There's a flying one. I think there's a white one in this game too. Or there might only be five. But look at this, bro. We can whistle. Do I have gyro controls on? Uh, I kind of want. Do I want gyro controls on? Hmm, that's something I gotta decide later, but we can actually throw. Oh, yes, sir. Look at this. Toss in my boys. I think I'm a gyro control on this. Can I actually change that? But yeah, look at this. We can toss Pikmin, and we can form an army of, like, over 100 of them, and just start whipping on people. Like, this is just, like, an intro. We'll get through it and be able to roll. I can move like this. That's how I throw. I mean, this isn't too bad. Hmm, and how do I whistle? How do I whistle? Again? Okay, it's B. So B will actually form all these guys and make them come back to me, into my army. Pretty cool. Let's just throw these guys. Actually, I don't mind this. Instead of gyro controls, I think I'd rather do this one. Let's do this one. Get it, baby. Come here, boys. Come on, everybody back. Back in my army. We got all the mushrooms done. Let's roll. My squad's 17, and there's 30 on the field. There's 30 on the Can I get more? That means there's 30 in total around here. Come here. I want all the Pikmin. I want to set up my army. Press ZL. Let me see. Okay, ZL. Okay, there we go. Can I get you? There you go. There's my boys. I'm looking for you guys. There's still 10 missing, which I really want. Still 10 of these boys, which I really want. But like I said, this is just like the intro. We're just going to run through, collect our army, and actually start day one in today's video, which is actually pretty cool. Day one, well, like I said, it's level one, basically. We're going to go over here. I heard, my, I heard more of you pick them. There you guys are. There my boys are. I was looking for you guys. Get over here. What an enormous mushroom. Yeah, yeah. The more Pikmin you throw on it, the more damage they do. See how, like, each thing kind of has health. I'm going to leave you guys over here. Can I roll over here? No, I cannot break this. It's too hard to break. I actually need rock Pikmin. The reason I do know that is because this is the, the deluxe version, and I played the original on the, the Wii U, which I absolutely love. I absolutely love. Such a good game. So I'm wondering what the difference is between this deluxe version and Pikmin 3 normally. So hopefully they added, like, new stuff. I think they added a uh, different mode, which is pretty cool. But let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll. But the best part about this game is how it makes you feel. It makes you feel like you're in a whole different world. Like, look at this. Like, we're in little caves. We're going to fight bugs and stuff. Yo, look at these things. Look at these things. <laughs> it's kind of how the game goes. You, you find, like, bugs and stuff, and you got to face off with all these monsters. Get them. Send them. <laughs> My boy's slapping up on them. And then, oh, what is that? What is that? Is that, like, an invisible bug? No, I'm not dealing with that thing. I'm not dealing with it. Ain't happening. Let's go. We should get slapped up. Because I kind of forget. I haven't played this game in forever. I think it came out in, like, 2013. Right? Pikmin 3. 
but this is actually where day one starts everything else was kind of just like an intro to the game but this is day one let's get it going we're going to be using alf there's three different guys in here i don't think almar's in this game i think it's alf Brittany, and that green guy but like alf's mainly like the main character almar i don't think he's in this game i think almar's like a pikmin one and two kind of guy but our ship crash lands we gotta go find it. we gotta get after it. it's called the drake and it's actually pretty cool because you can collect things and send them back to the ships like fruits and all that for yourself which is kind of like it's it's an exploration slash collecting game which is so much fun it's a miracle i'm alive somehow unharmed my oh boy yo alf yo let's get after it let's get after it alf i'm ready to go yes sir yo pikmin yo i absolutely love this game i was actually really hoping they were gonna make pikmin 4 but pikmin 3 deluxe i guess it will do i guess it will do but here is our first red pikmin what what was that let's get it where's my boy red pikmin i saw you over here let me hop down here where you at, boy? There you are, yo. Pikmin. What is goody? And we got a little flower plant right here. Which actually forms Pikmin when you collect a uh, little, like... I don't, I don't even... Pellets, I think they're called? I think they're called pellets. You guys will see in a little bit. Yeah, yo, look at this thing. It's a little flower plant. And what's that thing stuck in the branch? Yo, you guys know exactly what it is. It was in the other game, wasn't it? Get it. Come on, Pikmin. We can whistle. So I guess we're teaching another, like, little intro thing here. I'll call that thing. With ZR. Oh, there we go. Now I can throw Pikmin at this thing and knock it down. So, like, certain items, in order to get them down, you need a certain amount of Pikmin or a certain amount of certain Pikmin in order to knock it down or complete tasks. You guys will see in a little bit. Like, this is just going to be, like, a beginning kind of video. And then, like, starting, like, in the next episode, we're going to be thriving. We're going to be getting after everything on our own and just figuring out puzzles and all that good stuff. But, yeah, it's just something about this game. It has exploration, collection, and puzzle solving all in one. It is so much fun. And it's in, like, a different world rather than just, like, Legend of Zelda or, like, Mario and all that good stuff. But we can lock on with ZR. Usually, I use the motion controls for the Wii U. But I think I kind of like this. I kind of like the non-motion controls. Look at this. We got bridge piece right here. Oh, yeah, we got another Pikmin. Come here, boy. So, over here, we actually have a bridge. And see how there's three and 12 pieces? We need these Pikmin to pick up the bridge pieces. Yo, what are you doing, Pikmin? You gotta, you gotta go get the bridge pieces, buddy. Go over there. And they're gonna actually build the bridge for us. We don't really do anything. Like, the astronaut guy, Alpha, over here, he doesn't really do anything. Just, uh, what's it called actually does everything. Our Pikmin. We just kind of control and let them know what they're doing. Yo, did I tell you guys to stop? Get back on here. Pick up your bridge pieces and get over there. These Pikmin are like a little slaves, actually. <laughs> Look at them. Build the bridge. Get it. <laughs> So, like, say I had, like, a squad of 100 Pikmin. I would just finish this in, like, two seconds. I would just throw 15 on there, and we'd be rolling, and they'd be done the bridge. But since we only have an army of four, we gotta wait our turn right here and have these dudes do it. But eventually, when you get bigger and bigger into the game, you, uh, save up Pikmin, and then you can create your army of whichever ones you want. I can put, like, 20 fire Pikmin in my army, 5 rock, 30 electric. It's, it's just pretty cool. It's pretty cool. But there you go. Uh, we do not... You can stay here. We only need three over there. There you go. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Pikmin. But yeah, it's so cool to see your army actually start to form and all that. Because you start off with low Pikmin. So you start collecting them and all that good stuff and saving them up. Good work, guys. Good work. I love you guys. We built ourselves our first bridge. Now we can actually make our way across the next area. Yeah, where are you guys going? Where are you guys going? Let's go. This way, boys. This way, boys. Let's go. Make our way over the bridge. And what is that? Oh, that's a little map. Okay, cool. I'm with it. Let's go get it. Let's go get it. Give me my map. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. So it's just a map. It's pretty simple. It shows us where to go and all that good stuff. Map data loading. <laughs> Great. Still works, of course. I expect nothing less from Cope. How do you pronounce that? Cope Engineer. I'll check my surroundings by scrolling through the Copa pad screen. Okay, so I can check my surroundings by using the right stick. Oh, there we go. So here's like the map for right now. Where's the Drake? We gotta make our way to the Drake, which is all the way over here. Yep, that's where we gotta go. So that's gonna be day one. I think it's one big world that you explore. I think that's how it is. I think that's how it is. And you do it by days. Okay, right, cool. Now we can get started exploring with the help of the coat pad. Beautiful. Okay, use the radar to check the map. Blah, 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 blah. We can take photos. All that good stuff. But my boy, yellow or red Pikmins are here. And these are the little pellets I'm talking about. I can actually throw over here. I can lock on these other ones. Can I lock on this one? And we can actually get these pellets. And what these pellets actually do, the Pikmin will actually bring them all the way back to this little flower over here. And once they do, it will actually form more Pikmin for our army. So these were the little pellets I was talking about. Um, is this a 1-1 one, one over here? Oh, yo, there's a little bug, yo. Yo, what you want, bug? Come here. Get him, Pikmin. Yo, no, my Pikmin. Get back. Bro, I need that Pikmin back. He's getting slammed up. Our Pikmin can actually die. I actually didn't say that. But yeah, here's the pellets. They form more Pikmin. I just gotta go over there and pluck them and we get more. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. More Pikmin is better. Oh, uh, where's this Pikmin at? Come here, Pikmin. I don't want you to die. Get back here. Uh, I'm actually send you right here. We're gonna go get this one. 
Like, these bugs could actually kill my boy Pikmin. Yo, he better not get slapped up. Yo, chill on him. Chill on my boy. Good work. Yo, he, he just did the, uh, he just did a nice Duke move. He deked him out. He's like, yo, get out of my face. Hit him with the one, two. Yo, look at all these Pikmin over here. We got more. I'm gonna collect my other ones. I actually have to go over here and pluck all these Pikmin out. There we go. Yo, my boy, Red Pikmin. Red Pikmin, my dude. <laughs> Uh, I think it just plucks. Yeah, if you hit A once, he'll just go around and pluck them all that are on the ground. Once you pluck them up, now they're part of our army. Yes, sir. Good work, little Pikmin. And see how I only need one there? If I say I throw two Pikmin on there, I will actually, they'll move quicker, which is pretty cool. Pretty cool. You know, this game, they put a lot of work into it. Let's go pluck the Pikmin. Now it's going to get wrong. We got 12 Pikmin so far. And we're going to go get after the bugs. I ain't dealing with them. I ain't dealing with them. But these are like little baby enemies right now. I'm going to just start sending them over there. Get them! Get them! Oh, they can, oh, they're gonna pick them up and bring them back to base. You guys can do that. Go ahead, pick them back, pick them up and take them to base. There you go, boys. You guys, you guys got them. They'll take them to base. We'll get like rewards for it. And this is a five pellet right here, that, which means they need five Pikmin to actually carry. Pretty straightforward. There you go. You guys got it. Uh, we'll throw a couple extra on that. Get on there, boys. Pick up the pace. Pick up the pace. You got it. Help them out there, Johnny. There you go. Good work. So we got eight Pikmin over there. Doing work. And I believe when you bring enemies back to base, you get more Pikmin of that kind that you took out. I believe so. There you go. Thank you. Good work. Pluck you guys. Pluck, pluck. Pluck and pluck. I think some of our Pikmin did die, which stinks. But so we're going to get we're gonna get Punny back from this five little die. I think you get, I don't know, maybe double the amount from it? Or 1.5 times multiplied? We might get seven Pikmin back from here. Get over here, boys. Let's see how many Pikmin we get from that. One, two, oh, two, oh. What was that, seven? Or is that a fiver? It's like six, isn't it? That's five. Okay, that is five. That's fine. Because from the ones, we got multiple. There we are. Now we're up to 21 picks, dude. Let's get it. Let's go, Pikmin. Let's get grooving. So I think this episode might be a little bit shorter because day one's pretty short. And then the other episodes do get longer, which is actually pretty cool. When the days get longer... Oh, we need 20 on this thing? Go ahead. Take all my Pikmin. When days get longer, you can, like, explore for fruits and all that. Like, fruits are, like, rare collectibles that you find. There you go. Oh, there you go. 20 Pikmin pushing the box out the way. This is what I'm talking about, yo. It's so cool. This game's so cool. It's very creative, and I really do like it. Look at that. 20. Oh, what is What is that thing again? Is that like a... I think it's part of the map. What? What's that? Yo, let's see it. Let me see it. What you mean? What is that thing? I think it's part of the map. Looks like something left data files here. Okay, so it's a data file, and the coat pack can be... Let's see what it does. Oh, we got one little Pikmin behind us. <laughs> the onion... Okay, it's called the onion. The onion is like a nest for the Pikmin. It... Both gives birth to them and provides them with shelter. Okay, cool. Excellent. The code pack can read the data files. So these creatures are called Pikmin. <laughs> I don't you guys know these things are called Pikmin. I think I think they don't know because of uh, what's going on. I think Alamar was in one and two. And these guys are just in three. We're installing your exploration notes. That's another thing on our pause menu. Pretty cool. We can go in and check all of our notes. They're like little uh, hints, I guess. Or teach you how to play. I love I love their little language too. Right, let's go, Pikmin. Everybody here. Let's roll out. Let's roll out and see what we got to do. We moved the box. We got over here. I want to fight some enemies, man. I want to fight some bugs and stuff and things. Going to the radar, the jerk should be through here. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the only way we can. Another data file. Let's see what we got. Go. Change the radar orientation with other settings options. We got these mushrooms right here, and I can actually slap up on these mushrooms. I don't know what slapping up on the mushrooms do. Maybe there's stuff under them. I'm going to just toss them all around here. Get them. Take them all out. Take all the mushrooms out. <laughs> The work picks. Oh, you guys are here. Come here. Come here, boys. And we gotta take out this last mushroom. Yeah. Eat it up. I don't know what taking out the mushrooms do. I think sometimes there's like stuff under it. Y'all can launch this soon. <laughs> Alright, so we got our 21. Anything up here? I always like to explore and check if there is anything. Because sometimes there's like stuff on the ledge. And like say, if there's something up there, I can toss a Pikmin up there to go grab it for me. Which is pretty cool. Like, can I do something with this mushroom? Uh, I don't think so. That would be able to lock on. Oh, but we have a wall. Okay. We got ourselves a lovely little wall. Who built this wall here? More signs of intelligent life? Heck yeah. That would be a good time to press the X button and perform a charge attack. I think they added this in. They added this in this game, a charge attack. I can actually go here and press the X and charge. And which is, that means I send all my Pikmin at once. <laughs> so now they're just tearing through this wall. Get it, boys. Whack it up. <laughs> they absolutely destroy it, which is which is awesome. Tear through, baby. Tear through it. My crew could learn a lot from this kind of teamwork. Let's get it. Okay, you guys come back here. I believe we're almost done here. Let me check the map. Let's check the coat pad. Cause yeah, I believe this. Okay, I believe this actually leads right here, right? Or does it? No, this cave leads out here. So this will lead us to the ship. Okay, so we're basically like pretty much done the intro video. 
Oh, man, I, like I said, it's going to be a little bit shorter today, and then the next video is going to be a lot better. We can actually do things on our own. My boy Alf comes out, and we find our ship, our missing ship that we needed. That's just straight right there. Let's get it. Let's get it. Because after the intro, like, videos can get up to, like, 30, 40 minutes. Or for a day, and that's what I plan to do a day of video. So, cannot wait, cannot wait. Let's get it, my boy Alf. Got someone on the radio. We're receiving a call. You come a transmission. Who could it be? Is it Brittany? Yeah! Elf! It's me, Brittany. You copy? Heck yeah, I copy. Thank goodness. I, th I think they all crash landed on different plants and eventually we come together. And we, uh, we, we, we find a way out of here or something. I made it through the landing on one piece of this. Uh, I'm trapped somewhere. Blah, blah, blah. And I'm star. Oh, she's hungry. She's hungry. Oh, no. We got cut off. I wonder how far away Brittany is. But at the very least, I'm thankful that she appeared safe and sound. Let's roll. Let's get in the Drake. Is that the Drake talking? <laughs> What's that strange sound? Oh, we gotta fight somebody? Oh, I think it's those typical Pikmin enemies. The big little bugs are like red and like yellow or red and white. I wanna see it. Show it to me. Show me my boy. Where's he at? I think we'll eventually we'll see him because at nighttime, that's why the days end. Then these big guys come out. Let's see. Come on, show it to me. Show me the big guy. We went inside of Drake. Come on, show me my dudes. Sometimes they show him after you leave. Let's go. I really want to see him. Have him run through. Please. Please. No, <laughs> I don't think they are. No, they didn't. But there we go. End of day one. There's a little onion. Our onions come with. Our onions come with. They fly up here into our little ship. Oh, dude, this game rocks. I'm so hyped for this playthrough. I really am. I really am. But that is the end of day one. That's the end of day one. And this... Right here is our food supply. Most supplies we brought from us, Copa, were destroyed. So we only have three bottles left. And what the bottles actually do, they are, uh, I think, they're not, are they lives? We have three days worth of edible preservatives left. Okay, so we cannot survive three days. Each day, you drink one. So in order to get more, you have to find fruits to survive. And if you run out of all of them, I think you just lose. I think maybe your whole game ends. I, it actually never happened to me. It's not too hard. I think it's harder in the others, like the other uh, hard mode and all that stuff, or ultra spicy mode. There's a little Pikmin thing. View and replay with a uh, fine tune strategy. Okay, cool. So that was day one right there. We got no fruits. We got two bottles left. That's not bad. And we have 21 Pikmin. I think I can go around here and, yeah, see all of our what are these badges. That's how you like 100% the game. And what's rank do? Oh, that's, that's a rank. Story badges, side story badges. Nine more until next rank. Right? Oh, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool they added all this. So you got like a different achievements to do. I definitely kind of want to try to find like all the fruits and all that good stuff. And Maybe 100% this? Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys would like to see a 100% playthrough for it. That could be question of the day before we do finish this video off. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be getting started with the main parts of this game and doing a lot more, well, what we can do. We can do a lot more with uh, playing by ourselves and not really dealing with the intro and just basically showing off this game to its fullest potential. But thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.